Digital documents can be uploaded and stored in Xero, as well as attached to transactions, contacts and fixed assets. Your file library is accessed through this open folder icon in the top right hand corner. Already set up is the inbox and a folder called contracts. The contracts folder can be renamed or deleted. I'm going to rename this to purchases and save. As you can see, you can use this new folder link to create as many folders as you wish. And then you can store all your digital documents in the different folders and it makes them easier to find. If I go back to the inbox, there are several ways to get digital documents into your library. The first way is to use this unique email address to forward documents into your inbox. Every Xero account has a different email address. The second way is you can upload files that were already stored on your computer. So I'm going to upload this thank you here. And there it is. Another way is you can drag and drop directly into your inbox. And the last way is you can take a photo using the camera on your laptop or if you have a camera attached to your computer. Once files are in the library, they can be moved to other folders. They can be renamed or deleted, or they can, you can use this setting to be able to get directly to where you want to go to have this particular um, document attached to a transaction. Some, like a sales invoice, a purchase invoice, an expense receipt, receive money, spend money, or to a fixed asset. So if this is a receipt, I might want to just go straight to purchases and create the purchase invoice. And then I have this receipt already attached. You can see where this paper icon now with the corner turned down and that is where you can attach as many of the documents as you like and you can see we can add documents from our library or we can upload files directly to this purchase invoice. So I can also go about attaching digital documents to transactions without using the library by bypassing the library completely. So let's go to a sales invoice and a new invoice and we can see the paper icon with the taunt corner turned down. So wherever you see this icon throughout Xero, you can upload documents. So you can upload from the library or upload directly without going through the library or you can simply drag and drop onto your transaction.